Hello out there in cyber world. Um, today is October 1st and as many of you might know, some of you might not, October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month and in honor of it I wanted to do something. So I decided that every Monday I'm going to either make a video and post it on here um, or I'm going to write a poem um, some kind of blog, something, and post it on my Facebook. Um, domestic violence is a, a very serious issue for men and women everywhere. I mean, I, I can't even just say America. It's an issue that we as a, a people face all around the globe. Um, I can't really say that I've I've had an issue um, before, but it's not something that I've been continuously exposed to, but I know people that have. Um, and for one reason or another, it's something that's near and dear to my heart. Like for example, some of you, a lot of you guys, I don't know who's going to watch this video or what have you. but. Um, I'm going to school for sociology and I want to work with troubled teens, battered women, you know, people that struggle with addictions. I just, helping people with their problems is something that I've always felt passionate about. And it just so happens that one of the things that I kind of want to fall under that umbrella of what I want to do with my life is domestic violence. I can't really explain to you why I'm so passionate about it, but I am. Um, I don't want to really get into too much into this video because it's just an, an introduction and I kind of just want to let you all know, you know, where I'm at and what I plan on doing. Um, but I just want to say it's not your fault. I don't know, again, who's going to see this, what you're going through but it's not your fault you don't have to take that from anybody and don't be confused and just think that if you're a man and you're the one that's being abused don't let society tell you that you're a punk because you're not and it doesn't just have to be physical abuse it can be emotional mental sexual abuse you know just because you've been you're in a relationship with somebody and you've been sleeping with them for the past 10 years and one day you decide hey I don't want to have sex with you you tell them no and they do it anyway guess what they violated you that that's a form of domestic violence you know just because you slept with somebody one time I don't care how long y'all been together you slept with them one time guess what that don't mean that they have an unlimited lifetime access pass to your hoo-ha or your pogo stick, mm -mm, that's not how this works. No means no. Um, but again, I don't want to really get into all of that. This is just, again, an introductory video to let you guys know. Um, and I encourage you, you know, if you, you've been a victim of domestic violence, there are, you know, many organizations out there that can help you deal and cope with it. It's not something that you have to go through alone. I mean, if you're currently going through it get help you don't have to stay there and take that I mean if you're the abuser get help I mean I don't know I feel like everything that we do in life it's for a reason you don't just wake up one day and say hey I'm gonna punch my wife or my husband in the face no it's for a reason something happened to you and you too you need help um but again, I done said this <laughs> five times already probably. Um, I don't want to get into too much into this video, but um, just be checking, you know, back to see if I posted, you know, something. I don't, I can't say when on Mondays I'm going to post it, but I assure you every Monday I'm going to post something for the month of October and kind of address this. And it shouldn't just be October, you know, that we 
are concerned with domestic violence because it's a, a year around epidemic. It don't just happen in October. Mm -mm. It happens every day of the whole year. Um, but again, just because it's October and it's Domestic Violence Awareness Month, I kind of decided to do this. So, um, I think that's all that I'm going to say in this video. Um, I'm actually about to go run some errands. My eyebrows need to be waxed, <laughs> so that's where I'm about to go. But, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.